Hey guys, it's Jess, your host for Mondays on the Beaver Bunch. And some of you have, uh, you've been asking about my model car that I've been working on. Um, I, it's, it's here, it's right here in this area. Um, it's in pieces still. Uh, I'm working on it. Who knew that it would take so long for paint to dry? So, um, I am still working on it and I will be sending it to my friend for her birthday a little, a little later than I anticipated, but she is going to get it, and yeah. So this week, somebody wrote in, um, and they, uh, let's see, I'm going to read a little bit to you. So they were talking about Rick Mercer. Um, I've never heard of him, but uh, apparently he's a big public figure in Canada. Canada. Um, and I guess in a recent video, he says that all public figures have a responsibility to come out and serve as a role model for gay teens. Um, and then this person says that he contradicts his argument because even though he's been openly gay for most of his career, he avoids talking about his personal experiences. I don't really know. Um, this is just from what this person has um, written into us. So uh, their their main question is to what extent do LGBT do LGBT public figures have um, as a responsibility to come out and act as role models for gay teens? Why doesn't that make sense to me in my head? You get what the question is. I get what the question is. So I've been sitting here thinking about it and trying to, I don't know, try to sort of like put my finger on um, how I feel about it, I guess. And this is what I've come up with. Um, I don't think that anybody is obligated to to do anything. Um, you know, a, a lot of people get into politics, you know, they get into politics for whatever reasons. I'm, I, I don't want to make um, generalizations, but um, everybody has their own reason for being in the limelight and, and doing whatever. Um, and, and using that for, you know, whatever they want, um, be it for the greater good or to make changes at the local city level. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I, I really just, I don't think that, um, this particular person, uh, or anybody for that matter is obligated to, is obligated to step up and, uh, be the, the gay spokesperson. Um, and if I want to sit there and, you know, I mean, obviously it's super easy to look at these, you know, Op openly gay public figures and say, well, why can't you, you know, why can't you make these changes or whatever? There's, there's more, t there's more to it than that. Um, it's not that easy. Yes, it would be nice if they all stepped forward, but consider the past however many years. We've had so many people step forward and, and come out. Um, we've had, you know, allies step forward and say, I'm not going to get married until, uh, you know, there are equal rights and everyone is, is allowed to get married. Um, so we've made small changes, and I can't, um, I can't take that for granted. Um, but I also can't have, you know, these expectations of every public figure. Um, so when I when I thought about it, I, you know, I guess I really thought to myself, well, if I if I have the time and the energy to sit here and um, criticize someone for. And not to say that you are criticizing at all. This is just how this is how I'm I'm taking this or perceiving it. Um, if I have the time or energy to criticize someone for not doing something, um, for for not doing something, for not fighting for my rights, for not using their their political power um, to do something that I want them to do, um, then I'm going to do something. You know, I might not be able to reach the amount the amount of people that they can reach, but you know, damn it, I'm going to try. And I think that's, you know, that's, that's the best that any of us can do. So in closing, um, yeah, I just, I really, I don't think that anyone is obligated to do anything. Not everybody is a spokesperson. Not everybody wants to be a spokesperson. So, um, I don't know if you want to do something, if you want to see change, my, my best advice is to, to get out there, join, join the cause, do something, volunteer, whatever, but you have to, you, <laughs> you personally, um, you have to be the change. 
that, that you want to see. You can't sit back and expect someone else to make those changes for you. That's it. That's my video. Um, I hope you guys have a lovely, fantastic week, and I'll see you guys next Monday. Bye, guys.